Hey everyone, hope you're doing well. Today's devotion will be out of Luke chapter 16, uh, and it'll be verses uh, 10 through 13. It says, uh, if you are faithful in the little things, you will be faithful in large ones. But if you are dishonest in little things, you won't be honest with greater responsibilities. And if you are untrustworthy about worldly wealth, who will trust you with the true riches of heaven? And if you are not faithful with other people's things, why should you be trusted with things of your own? No one can serve two masters. For you will hate one and love the other. You will be devoted to one and despise the other. You cannot serve God and be enslaved into money. And uh, in this particular scripture, when it talks about uh, being enslaved into money, um, that's obviously one of the topics. But um, the Pharisees, if you, if you read on in the next few verses, the Pharisees heard that. Uh, and Jesus was probably saying that uh, not necessarily just for them, uh, but it probably didn't hurt that they were right there as well. Um, and, you know, whenever you look at the whole thing about money is um, it can very easily become one of our masters if we're not careful, whether we have a lot of money and we want to hold on to it or we're always focusing in on on the the lack thereof. Um, basically, if it's pulling our attention away from God, uh, if we're not careful, then that can become one of our masters, that that's our primary focus, uh, that we're either don't have enough money and we're always trying to make more and more and more or if we're got money and we're just trying to be stingy with it and uh, you know it could be money it could be something else in our life maybe it's um, a schedule or some something else that's drawing our attention we just have to make sure that we're doing our best um, to to not put anything ahead of God whether it's you know through our thoughts or through our scheduling or whatever uh, because there are always going to be things out there uh, that it's going to be pulling for our attention, especially the more our so society like transitions and and increases in technology and all that kind of stuff. Um, you know, we're able to do more all at one time. But if we don't stop with our mind and, and, and focus in on what God wants us to do and focus in on our devotions and reading our Bible and going to church and all those kind of things, if we're not careful, um, then then essentially we'll allow other things to take place of that. Um, and just going back to verse 10, it says, if you are faithful in the little things, you will be faithful in large ones. And uh, that's tough for some of us sometimes because, uh, you know, we want God to trust us with all the big stuff right off the bat. And, uh, and it's more like a baby step type thing. And so we just need to make sure that we are faithful in the small things and we're faithful with what God has given us and, and the resources that he's given us, that we're using everything that he's given us in those things to do what he's called us to do. And then he will transition it into more uh, after that. But, but if we're not being faithful with the small things that he's already given us, he's saying, why, why would I trust you with more if you're not even trustworthy with the, the, the least? And so, anyways, hopefully that made sense. Let's pray real quick. God, I thank you for this day. I thank you for all the blessings. And God, I pray you order our steps. Help us to have a great day and honor you in every way. And uh, God, that we'll be faithful even in the small things. Uh, God, that uh, we don't allow uh, other things to pull our attention away from you. Uh, and that we just uh, focus in on what you've given us. In Jesus' name, amen. Y'all have a great day.